Neighbors, look! There's one with a hump, and one who can jump, and one who is well a little bit plump. Sixty-four, sixty-four, sixty-four Zule. Some like it hot, and some like it chilly, and some like it both ways, and that's a bit silly. Sixty-four, sixty-four, sixty-four Zule. Some are friendly, some are scary, but one thing is sure, not one is ordinary. The story of Casper the Chameleon. Hi everyone! Gather round! I've got a surprise for all of you. A surprise? Ta-da! I made a drawing of you all! Look! That's me! And that's me! Oh, the spots look great, Lucy! What about us? Yeah, where are we then? That's you, Tickles, and this is Giggles. <laughs> or maybe it's the other way round. Anyway, you're all there somewhere. I'm not in your picture. Who said that? I did! There's someone in that bush. Are you sure? I can't see anything. That's because you're not looking hard enough. I'm Casper. Wow! Casper the Chameleon. Magic! Not really. It's just camouflage. What's camouflage? Camouflage is rather complicated. Let me tell you a story. One day I was catching dragonflies by the waterfall. When? Granddad! Where did you come from? I've been here all the time. But I didn't see you. That's because I was using my camouflage. Camouflage? Yes. Uh, today, I want to tell you about camouflage. It's very important. Oh, important things are usually boring things. Granddad. Where have you gone? Don't talk with your mouth full. It's bad manners. This is camouflage. Chameleons can change colour to blend in with their surroundings. But I can't. Of course you can. Think about the colour of a bunch of bananas. <laughs> That's good. Now, think of a green leaf. <laughs> oh, stop, Casper! It's not a game. You must use this special talent properly. <laughs> I disappeared into the jungle with great plans of mischief. Oh. <laughs> well, Mr. Watermelon, fancy meeting you here. Uh -oh. <laughs> it's me, Casper. <laughs> Is it camouflage brilliant? No, it's not brilliant, Casper, and I don't think you're funny at all. <laughs> right, who's next? Audrey the ostrich had been sitting on her nest for a long time and she was getting thirsty. I'm going to the waterhole for a drink, little egg. Be good and I'll tell you a story when I get back. Morning, Natalie. You're looking well. What a 
lovely day it is. I was just saying so to my little egg this morning. Okay. You should see my little egg. He's getting so clever. Oh, I'm sure he'll be hatching very soon oh, now. Great. Yes, dear? Audrey, why is your egg rolling down that hill? Uh, oh! Little egg! <laughs> little egg? You're not my little egg. No, I'm Casper the Chameleon. Ha! I'm practicing my camouflage. Your egg is fast asleep in his nest. <laughs> it's not funny and it's not clever, Casper. Casper? Casper, where are you? I live in the jungle, you do too. How much skipping can we do? One, two, three, four. Ha oh, oh, it's no use. I'll never get the hang of this skipping, Toby. Try doing it a bit slower, Doris. OK. I live in the jungle, you do too. How much skipping can we do? One, hey, two. look. What is it now, Toby? It's another tortoise over there on that log. Look! <laughs> Let's go and say hello. You can go, Toby. I want to practice my skipping. I live in the jungle, you do. Hi there. I'm Toby the tortoise. Pleased to meet you. What's your name? Hello, Toby. My name is Casper. The chameleon! Oh, fooled you! <laughs> Jasper, I don't understand. Where did you come from? I was practicing my camouflage. Isn't it brilliant? <laughs> Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten! Ha! I did it, Toby! I did it! Toby? <laughs> Toby, look out! Sorry, Doris. I can't hear you. The waterfall is making too much noise. Waterfall? That's when I realized we were in real danger. Hang on. I'll get help. I am scared. What are we going to do? I don't know. We've come to have a word about Casper. He's been frightening all the animals in the jungle. And what's worse, he's pretending to be a watermelon. Oh, oh, I'm so sorry. I tried to teach my grandson to use his special gift in a good way, but the boy never listens. He always has to learn the hard way. Help! Help! Toby! Casper! Help! Skipping! Danger! Help! Slow down, Doris. We can't understand what you're saying. Casper and Toby are in danger! Danger? Where? The river! The, the river. river? Just then, Toby looked up at the sky and saw Seamus the Stork. Look! Help! Help! Seamus! Seamus help! help! He can't hear us. Then I had an idea. Huh? There's something down there. Better take a closer look. Help! Help! Seamus! Seamus. Hold on tight. Toby, you're safe. We want a word with you. You've got a lot of explaining to do, Casper. I'm sorry, Grandad. Where have you been? My goodness, you're all wet. Sure, and I'd all be a lot wetter. If it wasn't for your Casper's quick thinking, he and Toby would have gone over the waterfall. Casper changed his colour quickly so Seamus could see us. He saved my life. You're a hero, Casper. A hero? But I've been naughty. Oh, look, Casper's gone all pink. <laughs> He's embarrassed. <laughs> You've learned how to use your colour changing sensibly. I'm very proud of you, Casper. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the great.
great story, Casper. Will you change colour for us? Please? Well, all right. Just this once. Brilliant! Brilliant! Look, I made a drawing of you. But I can't see anything. It's just a piece of white paper. That's because it's a picture of you in the snow, using your camouflage. <laughs> Good night, Lucy. Good night, Casper. Good night, everyone. Sweet dreams, Lucy. Adam, the armadillo. Lucy. Hello, everyone. Ah, oh, where are you going for your holidays, Lucy? I'm supposed to go on an adventure play day. Adventure play, play day? day? Oh, that sounds fun. Can we come too? It's only for children, silly. Not for monkeys. And anyway, I don't really want to go. But why not? Some of the other children could be older and bigger than me. I might be eight years old. But it's nice to make new friends, Lucy. I'm not sure. What if the others don't want to play with me? I'm sure they will. Sometimes big kids can be little. Huh? And little kids can be big. Who said that? I did. It's a ball. A talking ball. Wrong! It's me, Adam the Armadillo. Would you like to hear my story? Yes, please. Better sit down comfortably then. One day, I was climbing up a mountain. Like all armadillos, I was quite good at climbing. And even better at rolling down. In the valley below, I could see Jazz the Jaguar, Leopoldo the Llama and Dudley the Sloth. They were getting ready to play a game of football. I wanted to play football too. Eee! Hello? Hey, look who's here. It's Adam, the Marmaladillo. Oh, I'm not a marmaladillo. I'm an armadillo. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing here, Adam? Lost your mom? I want to play football. You? Play football? <laughs> Don't make me laugh. Here, catch this. <laughs> you can't play football. Football is for big animals only. Animals like us. Definitely not for Marmaladillo. It's Armadillo! Armadillo! So I just sat down quietly and watched the others play. What are we going to do now? I have an idea. You wanted to play football, didn't you? Well, now you can. Oh, really? Thanks. Which team can I be on? Can I be on your team, please? You're not going to be on anyone's team. You're the... Football. <laughs> but I don't want to be the football. Well, if you're the football this time, next time you can be on my team. <sighs> okay. Yahoo! Goal! One nil. Hey, man, that's not fair. Caught 
the code. Shoo! Maybe you should run to your mommy for some medicine. Shoo! One o. Hey, watch this. It looks dark and creepy. The sort of place where monsters live. And Adam's in there. We must get him out. After all, he's only a little animal, and we're big and brave, right? Yeah. So we should rescue him. What are you looking at me for? You go in there. Me? Why me? You go. No, no, you. 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 Stop it. Let's draw straws. Leopoldo drew the shortest straw. Go on. Hello, Adam. Help! <gasps> There's a monster in the cave. It's big and fierce and ugly, and it's got a terrible roar. You've got the next shortest straw. I'll sort out that monster. I suppose it's my turn. Dudley stayed inside the cave for a very long time. We'll have to go in together. Together we won't be scared. So, that's what Jazz, Leopoldo and Dudley did. Stop that noise, Leopoldo. I can't help it. Look, over there. Adam. Are you okay? I'm fine. It's <laughs> show. Don't worry, Adam. We'll save you from the monster. Monster? What monster? The terrible monster with the terrible roar. It's <laughs> show. It must be really close. That's not a monster, silly. It's just the echo of my sneezes. <laughs> See? You weren't scared of me, were you? After all, I'm only a little animal, and you're all so big. <laughs> <laughs> Football. But this time I wasn't the ball. Yeah. Yeah. It's time for bed now. Remember, it's adventure time tomorrow. Good night, Adam. Good night, Lucy. Sweet dreams.